research paper on the corporate agricultural you company. Stand. Oh yeah, we can't yeah. See you. <laughs> I did my research paper on uh, Monsanto, which is an agricultural company. And they're very, uh, they think you probably eat a lot of their food daily. Um, so I just like, first off, before I begin talking, I just want to pass this out. I have two different kinds of food here. Um, one's made from Monsanto and one's not. But I'm not going to tell you which right now. So, that's not this first. I want you kind of like to remember what the taste is like. If you can. Okay. And it's just, it's probably, gorgeous, yeah. it's, yeah, it's, oh, they're, they're packed in there. I'll go ahead and just put it on her, oh, okay. her napkin since I'm going to be following you around. Okay, sounds good. Cool. Senators. There's people that work for Monsanto, and they are actually uh, 
got Congress jobs once they left Monsanto in the agricultural industry and like for the FDA. And this really does a lot of bad things for them. So uh, it's not that uh, it's not that good. Anyways, I want to get a topic. Did you get, did you get all around? Or? Did, did, I don't know if you gave it to the okay. Did you guys hear something? Oh. Okay. So that was kind this of is the first one? Do you have more napkins over there? Yeah, of course. Sorry. I just want to make sure. So, um, raise your hands if you like the taste of the first ones better. Do you like the taste of the first ones better? The only one? Really? Yeah. Raise your hand if you like the taste of the second ones. I like I'm trying to eat. Okay. So the people who raise their hands for the second ones, you probably eat healthier foods than most people, because uh, if not, then you actually have a really good taste buds, because the first ones are Monsanto, and they are genetically grown, and they are just, if you look at the size in comparison, they're huge. I mean, I could probably fit two of these in the size of this one right here. And so they're not really grown for taste, they're not really healthy for you. So the main problem is that if it's not really healthy for you, if it doesn't taste good, then why are you eating it? You know, like, why is it being sold? Why is it in banned? Um, there's no long like term studies on Monsanto to show like if it's bad or good. So if there's no study on it, then there's no way to determine that if it's gonna be healthy for the public. Um, I don't know, that's pretty much about it. That's right. <laughs> Does anyone have questions for about the mic? No? Is that it? I do. Yeah. How do they um genetically modify the seed? Like, do they inject it or yeah, something? Yeah, actually, they, they put it into a lab, laboratory, and they splice the gene, and they put the gene into it, and then they grow it into a lab. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's under the seed. So it's not even the, it's not ground size growing like a test tube. Cool. Our petri dish. So when you bought the oranges, mm -hmm. were they, like, marked? Yeah. They're marked non-GMO or whatever? Yeah, they're marked organic. Oh, okay. I bought them from an organic local place. Okay. So that's why. And then I got a... Uh, yeah, so if you go to the grocery store and you're buying just conventional um, oranges or whatever, it's, uh, you can almost guarantee. Yeah, well, if it's conventional oranges, yeah. If there's, they go by a numbering system. Oh. So there's like, um, if there's a nine in front of it, that means it's organic. So you know, there's like a four-digit code on all produce. Yeah. If there's a nine in front of it, that means it's organic. And if there's not a nine, if it's no digit in front of it, that it means it's. GMO. Okay. And there's another number that you rarely see. I think it's a five. It means it's conventional, which means it's not genetically modified, but they spray it with pesticides. Okay. So there's actually oh, three. Enough. Yeah, but they don't so really sell those. Actually mean something other than the yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay, yeah. right on. So, any other questions? So what what made you interested in um, learning about Monsanto? Um, I eat organic foods usually. Okay. So. And you work in a grocery store, right? I used to. That's kind of where it all started. Okay. If you guys want more oranges, let me know. I'm not going to eat them all. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.